Bye. Drive safe. I love you. For most, visits to grandma's house usually mean more baked goods and hugs than you can handle. But for me and my family, it also means paintings on top of paintings on top of paintings. This is some steampunk that I did, which was fun to paint on. Huh? Because my grandmother, Jacqueline Wright, is an excellent artist. Okay, and of course everything, everything was hanging in this house. That one's interesting because it's painted on glass on the outside, I mean on the inside. So it's in reverse. Mm -hmm. This one was neat. My grandma has been painting since 1985. Started in oils and then went into acrylics. I've done a little watercolor now, and pen and ink and colored pencil. Melon. White. I basically like colors and I like to play this with is them. Going to be our highlight color. This is on that black tar paper. She credits most of her work to her participation with painting groups like the Village Painters. I've been in this group maybe about 10 years. I was in another group probably a total of 20 years and I belonged to Nationals since the mid 80s, so about 40 years. Lessons are completely created, hosted, and taught by members of the club. So it takes it takes a while. It's the, the people that are volunteering to do this have put a lot of their time into it. However, like many classes these days, the Village Painters now host their meetings over Zoom. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. But with an aging demographic, technical difficulties are to be expected. A lot of the older people didn't even know how to use the computer, let alone Zoom. The Vice President, Denise Roberts, went so far as to hire a Zoom tutor to continue teaching classes. So it was a learning experience for all of us, but we, we did it. <laughs> the move to online instruction was a controversial decision at first, but one that seemed to pay off for the painters. Oh, absolutely helpful. I mean, that was such a rough year for everybody, you know, and especially the older people. I think we were more frightened to get into groups, into gatherings because, you know, there were a lot of people our age dying, so um, we were taking it pretty seriously. So, so Zoom was awesome. For the painters, Zoom provides a convenient workaround to many challenges faced by their aging demographic, as well as an invaluable link to their community. This gal second gal okay, down over there, time, she's the next one down, is the girl I paint with I'll every week. Know. Which for a diehard painter yes, like my that's, grandma, that's, that is most of my friends because that's what we do, you know. So we have gatherings, we have potlucks, and I think it's my sanity. <laughs> it's my release. I can get lost in my own little world when everything's going on around you. You can just turn the world off and enjoy what you enjoy. And after the year we just had, who can argue with that? With Jern 206, I'm Molly Wright reporting.